Hi, I'm Jeff with Miss Kate, and I'm going to show you how to adjust your Miss Kate Universal Cutting Mat to work better in your Silhouette Cameo machines. If you look at our mats, they are the same size and dimensions as the Cricut mats, which is great for Cricut users, but if you have a Silhouette machine, you're going to notice you can see it's about a quarter of an inch too tall and about an eighth of an inch too wide. The easiest way to fix this is to put a few marks on our Miss Kate mat. Um, what I start out by doing is lining up the grids on the Cameo mat, the Silhouette mat, and the Miss Kate mat. This will put our grids in the same spot and allow us to figure out how much to shorten the mat by. And I also like to put a little mark on the side the same width as the Silhouette mat. You can use a guillotine cutter if you like. I find that it's a little more accurate if you just use some really sharp, good scissors. I just cut a straight line about two inches long on both sides. And That's all it takes. Now you can see you can see what I've cut off of the mat and you can also see the little mark that I've put. What this is going to do is tell us where to put the mat. I have already printed out a design, a print and cut design. I just put it on the grid right where I want it. This little longer notch will go right under these springs just fine. And then the line you put on the mat will line up right with the mark on the Cameo. Basically, the Cameo thinks that this mat, the Miss Kate mat, is the same dimensions as the Silhouette mat and everything is in the same position. So it cut it pretty good. There we go. This is also going to help when you only have like a 2x3 and you put it on the grid in the 2x3 position and load it the same way. You can see that it put it right where I wanted it on the mat. So if you're willing to cut a couple notches and put a little line on your Universal Miss Kate adhesive cutting mat, it will work great with all the Silhouette machines.